Hi guys, welcome to today's Word of Faith. Uh, my name is Albert. This week we are focusing on happiness, joy. Um, and there are four levels of happiness as I would categorize them. One is short term and this is, um, you know, giving yourself joy. And they say, um, you would hear this on the streets when I say, Mangaraha Jipe Mwenyewe. This is short term. It can take you probably just a couple of hours. You know, you'll tell yourself, you know, today I'll choose my own happiness. I'll do things that, you know, you make that list. But at the end of the day, if you just do an audit, um, you'll find that things happened and then um, that kind of happiness doesn't really last. And then secondly, there is um, a midterm kind of happiness, uh, which comes from your own supply of, you know, extrinsic aspects. It could be from work, um, from, from material things. You can buy a car, you can buy some clothes, you can buy a shoe. And this, this is really midterm, mid, medium term because it can take you, uh, let's say, like what, five months? So you'll be happy having that shoe and then you'll get another one. And then there is long term. This is a good kind of happy because it gives you um, a long time kind of happiness, which comes from family, from friends, you know, from the relationships that you have. And, um, you know, it borders just, uh, it just borders where joy begins to um, become constant in your life. Um, it's long term, it's good, it's productive, it's a good kind of happy. But then there is one kind of happy that Jesus spoke about in John 10.10. 10. He says that the thief comes to steal, to kill, and to destroy. But I, Jesus says, have come that you may have life and have it abundantly. And what happens is that, uh, when, what, what, uh, what happens is that Jesus gives you this um, happiness that is not only short, medium or long term, but it's eternal in nature. Why? Because one, he's everlasting. Two, because his word is pure, it is flawless. Three, because he does not lie. The Bible says in Numbers that he's not son of man, that he should lie or even change his mind. And so I'm just here to remind us, to encourage us, that the happiness and the joy that comes from knowing God and uh, that comes from creating it and solidifying it on Jesus Christ is not one short term, medium term or long term, but it's eternal in nature. It transcends all situations and even circumstances. And so this is my reminder to you and I pray that you will find this joy that is abounding, that is abundant and that can never fail. So be blessed and have a good week. Baraka.